an airline passenger takes on airport screeners. He says they searched him unconstitutionally and he recorded the whole thing on his iPhone. Wait until you hear this. A battle is brewing between the agency that oversees airport screeners and attorneys representing a man who says he was searched unconstitutionally. The man says the proof is on his iPhone. Let's bring in our Homeland Security correspondent, Gene Reserve, to explain what's going on. What's going on, Gene? Well, Wolf, the American Civil Liberties Union is suing the Secretary of Homeland Security, saying uh, that, uh, that uh, over what it calls unlawful searches and detentions at airports, the potential evidence is a tape recording of TSA screeners. This iPhone captured the conversation between a Transportation Security Administration agent and a passenger. I'm just trying to ask some questions to figure out what all this is about so I can get you on your plane. But you won't play smart ass, and I'm not going to play your f***ing game. The agent was talking to Steve Bierfeld. He works for the Campaign for Liberty, an outgrowth of the Ron Paul presidential campaign, which promotes constitutional rights. Bierfeld was flying out of St. Louis when screeners saw this cash box in his carry-on. At the time, it contained about $4,700, proceeds from the sale of political items. Although there are no restrictions on carrying large sums of money on flights within the U.S., the TSA detained Bierfeld and, along with other law enforcement agencies, questioned him for almost half an hour and appeared to threaten him with arrest. Unaware, the phone in Bierfeld's pocket was capturing every word. The question is, why do you have this money? That's the question. That's the major question. Yes, sir. And I'm asking if I'm legally required to answer that question. Answer that question first. Why do you have this money? Am I legally required to answer the question? Uh, so you refuse to answer No, the sir, I'm not refusing. Well, you're not answering. I'm simply asking my rights under the law. Swearing at me, cursing at me, uh, threatening to handcuff me, take me to the DEA and the FBI, uh, just the inconvenience. Uh, no, that's it's not with the bounds at all. The TSA says an agent has been disciplined for using inappropriate tone and language, but said in a statement, a passenger who refuses to answer questions may be referred to appropriate authorities for further inquiry. The ACLU says Bierfeld did not refuse to answer questions, and his detention and questioning violated constitutional protections against unlawful search. TSA believes its passenger screening is an opportunity to engage in freewheeling law enforcement investigations that have no link to protecting flight safety. ACLU and Bierfeld believe this incident is reflective of a much larger problem, but this passenger happened to be carrying a pocket copy of the U.S. Constitution and the latest technology. Wolf? Thanks very much. Fascinating stuff.